This is Boo. Her life has completely changed. We're gonna listen to her story. How was your life before you met James? Before James, I guess I was complaining the Lord, but I just knew that there was something that the Lord wanted to give me, but I didn't know what. And I was like, Jesus, I have a desire. I'm completely satisfied in you. Yeah. But I just have a desire inside of me. Yeah. And then when I saw James's face, I knew that he was the one the Lord had for me. Well, one day I just felt like led in my spirit to um, go on this website, Tumblr. And I saw a picture from this blog called Attractive Men with Facial Hair. And I felt like Jesus really wanted me to look at it. So I began scrolling through the pages of the blog. And I think I was on page 27 or something like that. And I saw like the most beautiful man after Jesus. Yeah, of Jesus course. Jesus is the most beautiful. Yeah. And I said, Lord, who is this man? What are you trying to tell me? And I saw that his name is James Vincent McMorrow. And James is, of course, a biblical name. Yeah, James is the name of Jesus' brother. You know, so I was just like, yes, God, I feel you. Yeah. And I discovered that he was a singer from Ireland. And I said, Lord, he must, he must sound heavenly. His accent, it just must reflect your image. And then I decided to listen. And after five seconds of hearing him sing, I was like, Jesus, I understand. You want me to marry this man. I agree, Lord. I accept your will. And you know, I just had to lay down my life and I said, Lord, not my will, but yours be done, Jesus. I'll, I'll go anywhere. I'll choose anything for you. Well, my outreach location is Iceland. And I just felt moved by the Lord to choose Iceland because Iceland is one letter different from Ireland. You just change the C to an R and it's Ireland. And also, it's a little bit chilly in Iceland. So the men have to grow beards so their face isn't cold. And I was like, Jesus, this is exactly what you were telling me when you led me to that blog and when you led me to James. And I just completely understand now. What, what has changed? Well, I'm no longer distracted. I'm really focused on the Lord because I know that when I meet James, it's going to be okay and we're going to get married. December 14th, right after our graduation this year, right after we graduate from DTS, we'll get married. And like, it just helped me focus on the Lord. I don't have to be distracted because I'm going to marry James. Uh, do you have an encouragement for people who are, yeah, still in the situation you were before you met James? I just say, listen to the Lord. Like, you just have to be wise. And, like. Even though I found James on Attractive Men with Facial Hair, just like be wise about what blogs you're following and make sure you're being led by the Lord to follow those blogs and don't just follow any blog. Follow the right one and Jesus will bring the right person into your life.